going on guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and if you're returning well welcome back so for this week's video I decided to do a weekend in my life during quarantine type of style it's currently Saturday I kind of forgot to film an intro yes I, I suck um, but I'm filming it now um, I just got back from cutting my hair and I'm currently just sitting out here getting some fresh air um, and I mean look at my view the pond looks really cool but yeah I'm gonna be taking you guys along with me this weekend I don't really do much so I'm not sure what we're gonna be able to get done um, but I will show you guys my weekend I hope you guys are all staying safe and I hope all of you guys are doing well um, like I've said on my last video I know these are really really hard times and trust me I I have been feeling it it's been rough working from home and just being home all the time not being able to see my friends I'm um, not being able to see my family really really sucks but I know it's something we have to do and it's for our own good so just stay home everybody do your part if we all do our part then this is all gonna be over soon so I hope you guys enjoy this video um we are going I may have done something to my hair I'll show you guys a little sneak peek um, and I'll show you guys that and then we will see what else we get done this weekend I know this weekend is also Mother's Day so happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there I hope you guys have an amazing quarantine Mother's Day with all your loved ones um, but yeah let's go ahead and get started with the video all right so I'm now in my bathroom I'm going to be doing highlights in my hair um, I've had highlights before um, but I've gotten them professionally done today I'm doing them by myself obviously quarantine I can't go anywhere um, and I bought this stuff so this is the stuff that I'm going to be using um, inside of this it comes with a cap but I'm not going to be using the cap um, I'm just going to do them pre-handedly so we'll see how it turns out So it says to mix until we get like a thick, creamy consistency. I think it looks pretty good. It's pretty mixed in and creamy. I'm also not going to do a lot of um, highlights because I don't want my hair to look completely like blonde. So we're just going to do a couple. Um, and the reason I'm not using the cap is because I seen I actually watched a couple YouTube videos before doing this, and um, a lot of the videos that I watched they weren't using the cap. Um, they were just like doing it free handedly and I mean I thought that was better because with the cap it was going to be harder because we have to use like this needle to poke the hole and then pull the hair through so this is going to be much easier okay so now that I have it done we're going to go ahead and get started putting it on the hair so what I'm going to do is if I look that way also it's because the mirror is over there so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to comb my hair down My hair is getting pretty long. Also, I have thin hair, but it's getting really long. Um, and then the way I'm going to do it is I'm going to comb it up and then just pull some of it out. How would I look with bangs, guys? My hair is curly. Okay, and then I have these clips so this doesn't get in the way. All right, so here goes nothing. Well guys, I actually decided to use the cap because it was actually really hard to do it without it. Um, and I had my mom help me take some hair out because um, it's really hard because you have to use this, you have to use this thing and then you poke it through and then you pull the hair out and it was very difficult. So I had my mom help me with that. I'm gonna try to do one right here. Oh, it actually worked. Look, I got one.
Okay, so I think it's been long enough. I really don't want my hair to fall off. It's looking pretty, pretty blonde. It looks like little worms. Okay, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and wash my hair out now. So, take this off. And then it also came with a shampoo um, to put on there. Um, but I also bought this purple shampoo to put on there um, just so we can take like the blindness away to see maybe it'll look pretty cool. But I'm gonna go ahead and take it off now. So I think I really like how it turned out. They're not too blonde, you can see them. I'm sure when it's dry, you'll be able to see them even more. All right, so I'm gonna leave it in here for 15 minutes, 15 or 20 minutes, then I'm gonna go shower and I'll be back to show you guys the results. Good morning, guys. It is now Saturday. Um, before I show you guys my hair, I actually am about to go get my haircut, so I'll show you guys the before. It's so messy, so I mean, you guys can kind of see how the highlights turned out, but my hair is really messy and it's pretty long. Um, I'm fortunate enough that my cousin knows how to cut hair, so he cuts my hair for the meantime. So I'm headed to his house right now. I will show you guys after, so this is the before. And then I'll see you guys after. And just like that, guys, we have our hair cut. Thank the Lord that I have my cousin that can cut my hair. Because if not, I don't know what I'd do. I hate having long hair. Um, that's basically the only thing guys have to do to groom themselves be besides shave. Um, and with the barbershops being closed, it freaking sucks. So I actually just picked up some sushi. I have it right here. Um, from this place near my house, um, it's called Sushi Ya. They have really good sushi and I'm so glad they were open because uh, I've been craving sushi a lot. Um, I had some yesterday, but I guess that didn't satisfy the craving, so I really wanted it again today. Um, so I came and picked it up and now I am going to head home and eat it. So I will see you guys when I get home. All right, guys, well, I actually just had my sushi and I came outside. Oh, it's a little bit windy. Hopefully you can hear me. I'm sure you can because I have this mic on. But I just had my sushi. Um, it was really, really good. And I devoured it really, really fast. But I wanted to show you guys my hair really quick before I jumped in the shower because I did get a haircut today. So I do need to jump in the shower and wash the hair off. So this is what my hair looks like. I only did a couple of highlights. I didn't do like a bunch of them. Um, I just did like a couple spread out because I didn't want my whole head to look blonde. But I am really, really happy with the way it turned out. So now for the rest of the day, I'm just going to hang out out here for a little bit, take in some of the fresh air. It's a bit windy and it's a bit chilly. So I don't know how long. I'm oh, there's the wind. I don't know how long I'm going to last out here. Um, but I'm not sure what I'm going to do for the rest of the day. And for tomorrow, I don't have any plans i know it is mother's day um, so i'm probably just gonna spend time with my mom i mean i've been spending a lot of time with my mom um but i'm not sure what we're gonna get into tomorrow uh, i do want to try to make mozzarella sticks later i've been wanting some mozzarella sticks and i recently got an air fryer and i've been wanting to try to do them on there um so i think i'm gonna try to do those later because i think i have all the ingredients um but yeah i will see you guys a little bit later okay so it's later on in the day and now me and my little brother alex we're gonna do some mozzarella sticks so all we're gonna need is the cheese the mozzarella sticks we're gonna need some breadcrumbs so these are like breadcrumbs that have some seasonings on them and then we need some flour and some eggs And just like that guys, we have the finished product. These are the mozzarella sticks. So now we're gonna do a quick taste test. See how they are. 
Mmm. <laughs> I'm good. Wanna try it? Uh huh. Good. Just good, right? Mm -hmm. So there you have it. Easy, quick mozzarella sticks. What is going on, guys? It is now Sunday. It's Mother's Day. Uh, me and my little sister, I mean brother, woke up really early. I'm gonna go buy my mom some flowers um, and my little brother's gonna get her a plant because she really likes plants. So we're gonna go ahead and do that this morning. Um, and yeah, happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. Um, I hope you guys have an amazing Mother's Day. Um, I know the circumstances are not the best, but I hope you guys make the best of it and have an amazing day. Um, okay, well, I will see you guys at the store. So we are back in the car now. Uh, we got the roses. Uh, my brother got her plant. Show the plant. Got her plant. It's pretty cool. It's like a little, what is this? Like a succulent plant? She's gonna really like it. I got her these flowers. They look pretty cool. Funny story, the lady forgot to take out the knife that she was using to cut and put the flowers together. Um, and when we got to the car, it legit just fell out of the bottom. So now we have a free knife. Um, but yeah, we are currently in pandas. Uh, we're going to get some panda for lunch. Um, surprise my mom with that as well. So I will see you guys when I have the food. Well guys, it is now 10 p.m. on Sunday and I'm getting ready to take a shower and then probably get to bed because I have to work tomorrow. But I just wanted to come on here and end the video. We didn't really end up doing much today. It was a really crappy day. It was really rainy and super cold outside. So we really couldn't do anything. And I mean, we are under quarantine. So we definitely couldn't have done anything. After going to buy the flowers, coming home with lunch for my mom, we had lunch. We watched a movie. We actually watched two movies and we just hung out. And that's all we've been really doing all day, just hanging out around the house. Um, but I just wanted to come on and end the video. But before I end the video, I want to show you guys a package that I got yesterday. I've been waiting for this for a really long time. Um, so I'm going to open it with you guys. And it's actually right here. It's something super exciting. Something that I love receiving. Um, and I'm going to show you guys what it is. I'm going to show you guys what the inside looks like. Many of you might already know what they are. This is what it looks like. Yes, it's another pair of shoes. I'm so, so excited for these. I've been waiting for them for a while. With everything going on, shipping kind of takes a long time sometimes. But yes, it is another pair of shoes for my shoe collection. I don't know if you can see right here. Um, those are all my, well, those are not all my shoes. I have some more on this side and then like my gym shoes and stuff are hanging behind my closet door. Uh, but yeah, I got a new pair of Yeezys. I got the black pair. They look so nice. I'm so excited to wear these. They look so nice. Guys, these are the Cinder, Cinder Non-Reflect, I believe. Um, I'm so excited to wear them. I don't have a black pair of Yeezys. I think these are my, these are my sixth, seventh pair of Yeezys. I'm obsessed with these shoes. They are so, so comfortable and they fit so good and they look really cool. So I got them on the Go app. That's normally where I buy all of my Yeezys. I think that's actually where I, besides one pair, I've gotten every other pair from the Go app. And they're always really fast to ship things for you. I really like it because they verify, they make sure they're authentic. It's like other people selling the shoes, but they send it to their factories and then they authenticate them for you and then they ship them to you. So you don't get them until they're authenticated and they make sure that you are buying the real thing and not someone selling something fake. But yeah, this is what the bottom looks like. The boost. I'm gonna do a shoe collection video one of these days to show you guys all my shoes. But yeah, they're mostly all Adidas. Um, but I'm so excited to wear these. Um, but I just want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Happy Mother's Day once again to all the mothers out there. And I will see you guys next week. Bye guys.